finding a right job is based on two things one is the right mindset and second is the right technique and here in this channel we cover off both these aspects in case if you are looking to move to germany how do i know all this well i am a recruiter and i hire for a lot of candidates here in germany so that's why i have created this channel to share my knowledge with all of you just for the record i'm shooting this video on 15th of may 24 so this is the latest information that i'm sharing with you of the current job market here in germany is the sample statements that you need to use in your resume now these sample statements are super important right which are the top 50 companies that keep hiring for marketing role here in germany this is a very very good list uh, that you can use in case if you are trying to find a job now we will go to which websites you can use to find a job here in germany for marketing role now let's go to the different websites that you can use to find a job in marketing here in germany or non it roles as well Hi everybody welcome to my channel Goodpreet in Germany and today we are going to discuss about the scope of non IT roles here in Germany especially focusing on marketing roles so it could be any role when it comes to the marketing category such as marketing manager marketing specialist performance marketing digital marketing seo specialist and so on so everything that falls into marketing category is what we are going to cover today and i am going to discuss with you what skill sets you can mention in your resume when it comes to these roles what are the most powerful and impactful statements that you need to mention in your resume for these roles especially if you are looking for a job here in germany what top websites you can use to find these roles what is the current market saying for these roles here in germany what are the top 50 companies that keep hiring for these roles and not only that even the list of startups in different cities here in germany who are hiring for these roles and specially focusing on english language being the primary requirement so it's going to be a super informative session for each one of you and in case if you are not from the marketing background still if you watch this video it will give you an idea of how do you create your resume for your specific role and what are these different websites you can use because most of these websites are common websites it's just that we are focusing on this specific role in this video before we jump right into the video i want to tell you in case if you want me to do any research for your role then please mention in the comment section so that i can spend my time into it also please hit like and subscribe in case if you like what i'm doing and it really motivates me to spend lot of time in doing this research and creating these videos for you not only that finding a job in germany or anywhere is directly related to how strong cv do you have so i also give personalized one to one session in case if you want to learn how do you create a perfect cv for you so that you stop getting rejection emails and you get more interview calls and not only that say if you do not have time to book my personalized session you can also take this quick course that i have created with this course you can create a perfect cv that's going to help you to find your dream job here in germany i have also created a similar research for data engineers role related to data science data engineering in case if you want to know about that please go ahead and watch this video and now let's get into this particular video focusing on marketing roles so let's get started and let me share my screen so before i share my screen let me clear a few doubts with you can you find a job in marketing from your home country directly well yes you can do you have jobs in marketing who only require english language well, well yes you have such jobs say out of 10 eight jobs might require uh, 
German language, but still there will be two jobs which will require only English language as the primary requirement. So it is possible for you to get the job from your home country or in case even if you are planning to come on job seeker visa and you specialize in this role, then also it is possible for you to get a job. Not only that, I have examples in my own network people I know who have come on job seeker visa and they secured a job in marketing. I also know people who have directly got a job as a marketing manager from home country and then they moved to Germany and now they hire for these roles. So it is possible to get a job. It is possible to find English speaking jobs. It just it requires a lot of dedication and a right technique. Finding a right job is based on two things. One is the right mindset and second is the right technique. And here in this channel, we cover off both these aspects in case if you are looking to move to Germany. How do I know all this? Well, I am a recruiter and I hire for a lot of candidates here in Germany. So that's why I have created this channel to share my knowledge with all of you. So now let me share my screen and show you different job titles that you can use in case if you're finding a job in marketing here in Germany. Now see one trick when you're finding a job anywhere is you use your own job title that you currently have and you search for the jobs. But every company has a different hierarchy and every company can call that particular role with a different name. So you need to search for jobs with different job titles and that will give you more list of more open jobs in that particular country, even in Germany. So now if you see here, these are the different job titles that you can use to find a job here in Germany. For example, if I'm using marketing manager and if I'm going on LinkedIn, then what is the result I'm getting? Just for the record, I'm shooting this video on 15th of May 24. So this is the latest information that I'm sharing with you of the current job market here in Germany for these roles. So now if I just put marketing manager and I do a search, I get around 3,700 uh, results for this particular role here in Germany, which is a great, great number. Now, not all these roles will match uh, completely to your criteria, but I'm sure you can find some roles which will match to your work experience. And if I see the jobs that are posted in past one week, I see 893 jobs posted in one week. Isn't that amazing? And also, if I see in past 24 hours, there are 169 jobs. This is just on LinkedIn that I am talking about. So this gives you an idea that there are companies who are hiring for these roles. There is a huge demand of these roles. Now, if I put marketing manager, I get that result. I can also put something called as any other job title, say marketing research analyst, right? And then I can search for jobs and then I get different results but I get more results. So sometimes it's very important for you to use different job titles to find a job. So in total, I see a lot of jobs available. So the different job titles that you can use is marketing manager, digital marketing specialist, SEO specialist, email marketing manager, advertising manager, event marketing manager, marketing coordinator, marketing communication specialist it can be anything that is mentioned here in case if you know more such titles again please mention in the comment section so that we can help each other and uh, what is important is sometimes it also makes sense say to tweak little bit of your job title even in your resume when you are applying for the role that definitely helps Say, for example, your current role is as a marketing manager. However, you have recently moved to Germany and you are also OK not having the managerial role, but also starting at a, at a say, analyst or an associate role. Now, when you have in your resume marketing manager, but you are applying for and marketing research analyst, so what can happen is most of the times your CV can get rejected because it is overqualified and that 
can cause little slowness in your job search process. So it's important to tweak that a bit and just mention uh, as marketing specialist, a more generic term, right? So that at least in the initial screening, your resume is not rejected. Now, these are the different skills or the keywords that are there for the marketing roles. Now, a lot of times you keep wondering what are keywords? What are ATS tools? How do you find these keywords? See, from my research, whatever keywords I could get, this covers maximum keywords that you have for marketing, SEO, SEM, social media management, email marketing, and so on and so forth. Now, you have to make sure that you're not lying in your resume. You are only writing the keywords or the skills that you have experience on. That is very important. One thing to note here in Germany is your interview will be based on your resume. Word by word questions can be asked to you based on your resume. So it's very important that you do not lie in your resume. And then one other way is you mention different tools that you have worked on. Now this gives an entire list of different tools that are available for marketing. But you have to only mention the tools that you have worked on. Uh, so that it can get more specific. Now, one thing is how do you find whether for this role, what skill sets or what keywords are there? So let me show you one thing here. Now here, if I am looking for a marketing role, a quick way to understand the different keywords is if I click on the skills section here and here you get the list of skills or the keywords that they are looking for. So if you click on this, so this is what they are looking for, you know, and then you have to make sure that these are the skills that are mentioned in your resume as well. And what it is also doing is this is matching with my LinkedIn profile and it is telling the recruiter how many skills are matching. And even you, if you click on it as a candidate, it will tell you how many skills are matching when it compares to your LinkedIn profile. So make sure your LinkedIn profile also has the right skills if you're applying for one particular role. Now, these are not the only keywords. This is because LinkedIn allows you to add only 10 skills uh, when you are creating a job. So definitely there are more skills that they are looking for. For that, you need to read the resume, but this gives you an idea. Now uh, comes the second, uh, third very important part is the sample statements that you need to use in your resume. Now these sample statements are super important, especially for any role and in case if you want to stand out. So let me show you this. One of the uh, roles that I was looking for here is a marketing manager for a company and there are over 100 applicants. Now, out of these 100 applicants, how will your resume stand out? And that's why it's very important to craft a great CV. And how do you craft a great CV is by giving numbers in your resume. So, for example, for a skill of marketing strategy, you can write something like developed and executed a comprehensive marketing strategy that resulted in 30% increase in brand awareness within the target market. Now you see you are giving numbers here. And one more thing you can add here when you're talking about the target market, you can also talk about which target market, which regions. It can be the target market in EMEA, Asia, APAC, whatever region that was your target market. And especially add if that target market is similar to the target market of the role that you're applying for. For example, in case if you're applying for this role and when you research about this company and their target market is say Germany, Europe, so then it makes more sense. And if you have experience in working in Europe as being your target market, then it makes sense to add the word Europe here because that's going to give hiring manager an indication that you've already worked in a same 
market before. Then say the other example is led cross-functional teams to align marketing efforts and business goals resulting in 25% increase in customer acquisition. You see what I'm doing here, I'm giving them results in each and every sentence. Managed Google ads with the monthly budget and then how much CTR was increased, how much was the return on the ad spend. Now this, I am giving them numbers. Now when as a recruiter or as a hiring manager, I see such statements, it automatically tells me that this candidate is super, super qualified. The candidate knows what it, he or she is talking about. The, and they have managed a budget, they know how to increase the CTR and so on and so forth. So it completely changes your profile if you have numbers in your CV. It's very important. Then uh, for everything, for brand management, for market research, everywhere I've given numbers, say for content marketing, developed an ebook as a lead magnet resulting in 1000 downloads and 300 new leads within the first month of the launch. So everywhere, just quantify your results. It could be as per your experience. It could be a, a small number, a big number, but give some impactful numbers in your resume. Do not worry in case if you need this document that I have specially created, you can click on the description below and then you can download this document. Which are the top 50 companies that keep hiring for marketing role here in Germany? So, and what are the different roles that they keep hiring for? So, definitely most of these companies keep repeating, but these are the big giants here in Germany. And of course, they keep hiring for many such roles. So, you can see there's Volkswagen, BMW, Siemens, Adidas, Lidl, Eon, uh, Metro, Railway, so many of these companies that keep hiring for different roles. If you see here, digital marketing, marketing coordinator, brand manager, product marketing manager. So one way to find a job is go to this company's website, go on their careers page and send them. And if you find a role, apply for it. Sometimes not every company will post a job on LinkedIn. So make sure that you go on the company's website and then send them your resume. The other tick, uh, tip here is go to the company's LinkedIn page and try to find a marketing head or a marketing manager there and just ping them on LinkedIn and say, I am looking, I have great experience in this and I'm looking for a job. Please let me know if you have anything for me. Not everybody will reply, but even if out of 10, one person is replying, I think that's a good networking. So that is how you increase your LinkedIn networking and you reach out to people. When it comes to job search, reaching out to people is super important. So do not shy away from that. Now, these companies which I'm sharing here, they can hire for these roles, but German language can be a primary requirement for few of these companies. However, I also have the list of startups that hire here in Germany in different locations, Berlin, Munich, Hamburg, mostly I see in Berlin. And because these are different startups in different companies, industries, say FinTech, EdTech, FoodTech, TravelTech, sometimes they hire for roles in marketing where German language is not required. English language is the primary need. And I'm also going to show you that in uh, LinkedIn. Okay, so definitely you can go ahead and contact them. Try to reach out to them and see if you have any jobs open for marketing uh, here in Germany. This is a very, very good list uh, that you could use in case if you're trying to find a job. Now we will go to which websites you can use to find a job here in Germany for marketing role. Now let's go to the different websites that you can use to find a job in marketing here in Germany or non IT roles as well. So definitely the first one is LinkedIn and I see 3,700 jobs here, but let me show you something. So here when I was going through these jobs, so I did find some jobs that do not require German language. So uh, let me quickly show you that. 
that will give you more confidence that yes there are companies hiring without german language being the preference even for these roles okay so for example this is the job digital uh, manager and uh, marketing manager and here i could not find german language being the primary requirement so i don't find anywhere it is written it is written that so if it is not written that means it is not the primary requirement and uh, similarly there was this another role trade marketing manager here also i do not find all they need is advanced english in speaking reading and writing they've clearly mentioned they have not even mentioned german is good to have so definitely they are looking for the english speaking candidates but you see here over over 100 applicants so it is very important for you to have a perfect cv for you to get selected for this role so on i could find more such jobs that have or that need only english language so definitely do not hold yourself back uh, thinking there are no jobs available german is needed yes german is needed german is needed for a jobs but there are still two jobs where german is not needed and those are the two jobs that we are going to focus on so uh, it is possible to find a job it just you need the right mindset and the right technique and i here help you with both so feel free to talk to me then the other websites that i could find here was iamexpat.de and uh, here i could find many jobs and more english speaking jobs in marketing so i think it's a very good website i'm going to mention all these links in the description below so do not worry about that there are around 10 jobs and all these are english speaking jobs so definitely have a look into it and they are also recently posted then there's another site that is called stellenenzeigen.de and here also i could find 396 jobs related to marketing and also in few of these jobs i could only see that english is the primary requirement even this particular job marketing assistant there is no mention of german language here so even if the job is posted in german please translate the job and read what it is asking some of these websites because they are .de they are focused for the german market so they post jobs only in german language that is the case but german might not be the primary requirement of the job it's just posted in german language so definitely translate the job and then try to find whether german is actually needed or not then there's another website called hey jobs even here i could find lot of roles related to marketing and some of these roles can be repeated based on linkedin and here but that also shows you that the company is in a real need and that's why they are promoting the job so much so you can definitely apply for jobs and then there is this good website that says englishjobs.de so not every job here is very uh, relevant to marketing as you can see electrical engineering but that's okay uh, i would not go by this number here but i uh, what i would do is i would go through the list and see which are actually marketing related jobs but these websites you can also use for your own role these are very common websites here that we use to find a job in germany so do not just stick to marketing this video is focused on marketing but in case you want to, you have skilled in any other role please go ahead and find jobs using these websites that's going to definitely help you and glassdoor is also a very very good website here to find jobs so definitely go through glassdoor and see uh, what are the different roles available this is also a very good title demand generation lead which you can use for finding marketing roles here in germany and then comes berlin startup jobs this is a very good website and i also know for in this website most of the companies post for english speaking jobs so definitely you can use this website to find a job for your role uh, and then comes jobs in hamburg this was one website that i could find but not many jobs but still i think you can 
try to do some research and find some jobs here then definitely step, stepstone.de is a very good website to use to uh, when you're looking for a job here in germany indeed is another good website that you can use in case uh, to find a job and finally i have a different websites that's called jobble.org so this was a very interesting a different unique website that i could find and i see around 44 vacancies here in marketing marketing jobs digital marketing sales you know uh, senior manager so go ahead and do a research on this website and see if you can find some similar jobs here uh, in Germany. In case if you want to know uh, the similar research for the data engineer's job, then please click on this video here. You will get this complete list. In case if you're planning to come here on a job seeker visa and you want to know the entire step-by-step -step guide, then this video is amazing. You have no other video that shows such details of job seeker visa process in fact in in this channel if you want to move to germany you are looking for different ways then i am posting videos which are very very informative i can easily create a video for five minutes and wrap this session up but that's not the interest the interest is for you to get the information in the best way possible so that you understand how does the system works here in Germany? And do follow me on LinkedIn and Instagram. I keep posting a lot of jobs as well because I'm a recruiter. I keep hiring. In case if you want to talk to me, you have any doubt, please go ahead and you can book my calendar slot and I'll be more than happy to talk to you and clear your doubt about Germany or about recruitment. I post videos twice in a week, every Tuesday and every Friday. There is going to be a video around 6 p.m. IST. So please go ahead and hit on that subscribe button so that you keep getting regular videos from my end. Thank you so much for showing me so much love and support. Have a great day and I'll see you soon again.